Hello, my name is uh, Luis Mendez. I am the forensics teacher. I teach forensics one and two for the NSI magnet, which is National Intelligence uh, Magnet, Security Intelligence Magnet. Uh, I've been teaching here for five years. It is a two-year program. We cover areas in ballistics, we cover blood spatter, we cover glass analysis, we do fingerprinting, we do autopsies like you are going to see in this video. Uh, and it's a real exciting class. We do a lot of hands-on activities. We go outside and we create crime scenes. So I would love to have you in my class. How do you like being in the NSI magnet? Um, it's really cool and interesting because you get to learn about new things every day. Like you get to learn about like how the body dies and like how to figure out how long to like they were dying. Okay. Uh, what is the most interesting part about forensic forensic science? Um, to me, the most interesting part is like figuring out like how how a person dies by their like blood splatter. Okay. Uh, what's it like being a Goldman student? Um, it's really cool and interesting because like I feel like the school is really welcoming, and like you can make new friends every day by like doing little things here and there. Okay. There you go. You actually went pretty deep in there. You actually removed both the skin and the muscle. <laughs> Alright, now what you're gonna do here is you're gonna cut, you're gonna start cutting with the scissor across here and remove this whole flap. Then you're gonna do the same thing on the other side. And let me go ahead and focus the camera so that you guys at home can see it well. So right now we're doing auto focus and you can see the whole section. Okay, what you guys can see already, this part right here, that's his rib cage. So we're gonna remove this flap now and expose the organs and then we need to cut the sternum, which is the middle of the rib cage. Once we remove the sternum, then guys, we can actually expose the heart and the lungs. And the first organ you're gonna take out is the heart. Kylie, you're gonna weigh the heart, and then you guys are going to photograph the heart for your assignment. Nicole Rodriguez, you're gonna be in shock when you come in here and you view. Nicole, are you in? Nicole, can you hear me? Let me auto focus again because it's getting out of focus. I could get the soundboard shot off. Yeah. All right, guys, so now you are seeing the intestines are going to be down here. And, guys, the small intestine is going to turn into the large intestine. The large intestine is very short but very wide, so that's why it's called the large intestine. This guy is very thin but very long. They call him the small. That is the stomach. Very good. In an actual autopsy, guys, they would remove the stomach, weigh the stomach of the victim, and then dissect the stomach to see what this person ate, especially if they suspect.